Hello, it's Matt and welcome to Collaboration Coach. In this video, we're gonna look at what Microsoft Flow templates are. So Flow templates are one of the best things about using Flow. Because other people have already created Flows and shared them, we can just reuse them without having to create our own. Now, when you come to the Flow homepage, which is flow.microsoft.com, even before you have to sign in, you can have a look at what types of templates there are. At the top, of the flow homepage, you can see we've got this search templates dialog. So if I was interested in a template or a flow that involved Gmail, I could just type in Gmail here, hit the search, and it would give me a list of all the existing flows that I can use that include Gmail. I could do the same if I'm an Outlook user. So I come up to the search and just type Outlook. You see there's a very long list of templates here. And for that reason, I can filter the list by these headers here. So if I just wanted to see, say, events and calendar, I could filter it that way. And I can also sort by popularity, name, and publish time. And you'll see each of these cards has a number on it as well, which shows you how many times that's actually been downloaded by other people. So you can see some of these have had a lot of use. So if I click on one of these, say this one here, save Office 365 email attachments to OneDrive for Business click on it it's going to take me through to this page where it gives me a small description and the next thing I need to do when I hit use this template is sign in you can't create flows or use templates without a sign in and that has to be a Microsoft account so it could be your existing Office 365 account or it could be another Microsoft account like uh, Outlook.com if I'm not logged in already and I hit use this template it's going to then ask me to log in down here now, if you are an Office 365 user, you can access Flow from the waffle at the top here. You'll see a Flow button, or you'll see a Flow button on the app launcher here. You might see it on your home page. So when you click on that, it actually takes you directly through because you're already logged in. And you'll see your flows, and you can also access the templates from here by choosing it from the left-hand side nav. And you can search templates in the same way. Now, notice the difference. When I click on the flow it takes me through to the same page where it describes what the flow is going to do uh, this time though uh, the template is asking me how I would like to connect because I'm already logged in it's happy for me to start connecting with these apps and services the connection is just the username or the account that I'm using to connect to flow in this case it's a dummy account called Megan B and because I'm connected I can just hit create the flow and when it's ready, it will take me through to the next stage, which is the, the Flow profile page, which gives me all the information about the Flow itself. So that's all there is to it. To use Flow templates, you just need to choose your template, log in, and your Flow has been created. When I go back, you can see this is the Flow that I just created, and these are the other Flows that I've created before. Okay, so that's the high-level overview of templates in Microsoft Flow. If you like this video, then please subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time.